Plastids are important organelles in plant cell. They are present only in the plant cell and they also have DNA and ribosomes. So like mitochondria, they have their own DNA and ribosomes so they can manufacture their own protein molecule. Apart from this, there are two types of plastids. One is chromoplast and other one are leucoplast. Chromoplast are having a different color pigments in that chromoplast are color pigment whereas leucoplast are white or colorless pigments. It has a pigment that is chlorophyll and that is named as chloroplast. So chromoplast has a pigment chloroplast and it is containing chlorophyll. So chlorophyll is important for the photosynthesis process in the plant. They also have orange and yellow color pigment. Now regarding chloroplast, internal organization of chloroplast has numerous membrane layers with stroma. They are similar to the mitochondria. So how the mitochondria structure is there, they are also having the same structure like mitochondria. So this is about chloroplast. Now leucoplast are white or colorless. Basically they are primary organelles who will store starch, oils and protein molecules into them. So leucoplast are colorless. Their function is to storage of all these materials that is starch, oil and protein. Whereas chromoplasts are colored pigment and they have one pigment named chloroplast. So chloroplast has a chlorophyll into that that is green color pigment and it is responsible for the photosynthesis process in the plant. Other than this green color pigment, they do have orange and yellow color pigments. So plastids are only into the plant cell and they have their own DNA and ribosomes into them. Hope this video has solved your doubts and in coming videos we are going to learn some more important concepts. So don't forget to subscribe learn yourself. I'll see you in next video till then keep learning keep sharing.